kids, the kids. It's all about the kids. We're focusing on them. It's time for us to make some noise with the crazy stores. Yes, we're going to do exactly that. And we want the truth. Oscar Child of the crazy store <laughs> yep. sent two years to kids across South Africa to get their credible views. Now, let's see what they all had to say about this. I've heard many people talk about how kids are such harsh critics. I think it's just because kids are just so honest without even trying. So who would be better toy reviewers than the kids themselves? We asked you to send through your top toy reviewers in the house and you did not disappoint. The crazy store selected a few lucky winners to receive a bunch of toys and to give their honest reviews on. After all, they're the experts. I have my dolly, it has shiny clothes, and it has red hair, and she got a shiny dress and shiny shoes. I like the dinosaur because it, it walks and it makes a noise. I got some, some boxing gloves and um, a boxing bag for um, the boxing gloves, and it's very cool. My sister thinks that it's a horse, but what it really is is a makeup set that, I, that it can open. It has two layers, one, two. The layer that I love is this one. I think it's lipstick or probably it's something else. My favorite is the train Some, and sometimes the boxing gloves too. And I've always wanted one of these. You know I like it. Kids have no filter, which can sometimes be difficult to handle. But me, I'm a big fan of honesty. As kids grow up, shopping for them can become very difficult. But we just have to listen to them. After all, they do know best. I'm having a tea party with Rainbow Ruby. I like the car because you can pull it back and can drive. The train is my favorite too. Yeah, you really like the train, but I just don't want you really to take it because I don't want you to really break it because I just got it like a week ago. <laughs> Most of all, my favorites, these ducks. I would name one, so I would make this one the sleepy one, and this one the alone one, this one the Sassy one and this one, the eating dog. Do I, I enjoy the rugby ball because I can take it to a park and stuff, I can play with it and it's quite fun to play with. You can open the kettle and you can pretend the hammer is some hot boiling water. You squeeze and squeeze and squeeze and squeeze till all the hot boiling water is out. The sleepy dog just says, but this one is just like, woof, 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 woof. Ah, oh, it definitely isn't mud cakes and marbles anymore. There is so much variety these days that it can be hard to keep track of it all as a parent. But luckily, these kids are clued up on exactly what they want. The toys have changed so much uh, since I was young. Uh, I do feel that the likes of Iana and her friends are quite fortunate with the kind of toys that they have. I mean, there's a wide variety of toys now, whereas back in the days, I only played with the just dolls. When I was a kid, I was allowed to play with cars and balls and any toys. I think toys have changed drastically. <laughs> There's so much more available now, I think, to the young ones, especially when it comes to like robots and things like that. Also, what I find with a lot of the toys nowadays, which as a homeschooling mom I go for quite often, are the educational aspects. So they're not just a toy anymore, they're actually a teaching tool as well, I find. I might be giving away my age and saying this, but I think kids are very complex. Sometimes they really do know everything especially when it comes to their own interest. So, who knows, maybe even I'll learn something here today. It's a big, big box. It's really cool. Really nice and blue, and I really like the colour blue. The, co the small pot must go over here. The big pot must be over here. The ball is my favourite toy because can, I can bounce 
slipped and found and I can kick it. The sassy dog likes to sleep in this one. She's used to it. And the lonely one just sleeps in its own. Nobody's allowed, allowed in it, just him and his loneliness. This is a microphone, and if you talk, and then it makes the same sound that you sounded. I like the piano because I can play music. If you're happy and you know, clap your hands. If you're happy and you know it and you really want to show. If you're happy and you know, clap your hands. Yeah, my human friends would love to get all of these crazy store toys and I bet all my friends would want the dog ones. The Crazy Store really has some great items, um, lots of variety from crafts to toys. Love the balloon section. I think the Crazy Store is popular with the kids because they have a variety of toys and there's always gifts that you can buy their friends or things like that. When I go to Crazy Store, I go to the toy um, aisle and it's very fun there. I guess it is true. Kids can be harsh critics, but you can't say they aren't honest. Luckily, after today, we can all agree that they truly are the experts. I definitely learned a thing or two, and hopefully you did too. Some valuable info to keep in your back pocket when shopping for your own little ones. A younger sibling or a niece or nephew. The crazy store is without a doubt the go-to one-stop shop. There we go. That's why we say make some noise for the kids because they really are the experts. Kids know everything. I think I also know a little bit or two, but I think that maybe means I'm still a kid, eh? Yeah, that, but also the toys you used to use when you were a kid is not the same thing they're using very now, true, my boy. Very true. Uh, there's a crazy store near you, so make sure that you do take advantage of their wide array, wide variety of toys for yep. the kids. Big or small, we have got it all. Everyone will find something at the Crazy Store. It's no wonder South Africa considers the Crazy Store the crazy fun place to shop.